down. My name's Richard Eschen, also known as Magical Bones. I've been doing magic since I was 10. I'm really nervous about this audition because, firstly, I think this is the biggest show in the world, so a lot's on the line. My girlfriend, she's from Canada, and we've got a little son. He's two and a half years old, and he's a little, a little angel sometimes. <laughs> I love you, Daddy. I miss you. We're sort of like a nomadic family. My girlfriend's a dancer, and she's always touring, so we don't get to spend as much time as we'd like together. Hopefully, doing a show like this will take my career to the next level, and I can spend more time with my family. It's not just about magic. It's bigger than magic for me now. This looks intriguing. Nice to meet you, nice to meet you guys. And what's your name? Uh, my name's Richard Essien, AKA Magical Bones. Oh, love that. Magical Bones, where are you from? I'm from Peckham. Yeah, yeah. You're doing magic, right? Yes. And what would be the ultimate dream? The dream is to go to Vegas. Do you think you could compete out there with the best? I think I can. Because I'm original and the stuff I do, I don't think anyone in the world does it. I love that. OK, I don't want to hear any more. Good luck. My name is Magical Bones, and I'm a street magician. And tonight, I want to show you guys something you've probably never, ever seen before. Ooh, let's hope so. Simon? Yep. Can you take one out for me? Yeah. So OK. I'm going to go for that one. Perfect. Shall I just take it? Yeah, take it out. Don't show it to me. I won't. But what I'd like you to do is write can your I see name. It? Yeah, you can see it. And then write your name nice and big on this side of the card, yeah? And then when you're done, you're going to just show the camera and show everyone else, OK? I'm going to look this way so I can't see. I'll take that back. And you're the closest. You can see that's lost forever. Yep. I want you to focus on that card, get it in your mind. Let's try this. What? What just happened? <laughs> oh, my days. Wouldn't it be cool if this is Simon's? Now, being a magician, I always get asked one question. How did I get into magic? I want to take you guys back to the 1800s, and I want to tell you about the man that inspired me the most. His name is Henry Brown. Henry was born a slave in Virginia, but in 1849, he decided to escape. He hid in a small wooden box and literally mailed himself to Philadelphia, Pennsylvania, where slavery had been abolished. I believe that single feat is one of the greatest escape acts in history. Henry eventually traveled to England, where he became a magician known as Henry Box Brown. In 1865, slavery was abolished in the US, and 10 years later, Henry returned home a free man. Throughout his life, he never stopped spreading his message of hope. Henry described himself as an African prince. This is the signature neckerchief he would wear in every performance. We're going to come back to this in a moment. Thank you, Sarah. Henry Box Brown liberated so many people of color, including myself. In fact, he inspired me to create this. Trapped inside this box, surrounded by 15 swords, with no possible way to escape, is Lamassi. No matter how impossible your circumstances may seem to be, there's always hope for a better day.
get there. What? Who are you? My head hurts. Magic of bonds. You're very good. Uh, David, that was really powerful, and you are a very powerful presence. So you've got that star quality that you really need to make it big. Thank you. Thank you. I don't even know where to start. What you represent is so much bigger, and that makes me just feel so proud. Hope this is the start of something incredible for you. Thank you well so done. much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, thank you so much for bringing yeah. sort of a real kind of coolness to magic, which kind of made it more real, but still so very magical. It was brilliant. Thank you so thank much. You. Thank you, guys. The magical acts I love are the ones uh, which have a story that continues through a narrative. And, and the stage presence is so crucial. Um, and you've got that stage presence. And the fact that maybe this show will give you the break you've been waiting for is a, is a really fantastic feeling. Thank you. Thank you. OK, now the important part. Let's start with David. I'm going to say yes. Yeah. Alicia? I'm saying yes. Thank you. I'm saying yes. Oh, clever way of saying four yeses. Yes, thank you so much. Thank you, guys. Yes! Well done! That was great. Fantastic. Babe, I made it through. Yes, yes, I did it. Well done, we're really proud of you, babe. Love you.